And as part of efforts to reduce high-level unemployment among the teaming youth and to end the rise in cases of insecurity, Watsia Development Association, BDA, Kaduna State Chapter, has trained and empowered youth, women and windows in various skills acquisition to be self-reliant. State Chairman of Watsia Development Association, Garba Litentapwa, says the aim is to eradicate poverty through youth empowerment program which is key to ensure safety of the people. Uh, in unemployment. Unemployment is the main factor of the insecurity in this country. If our youth were involved in doing one thing or the other, the rate of insecurity will reduce. Yes, agreed. Uh, somebody that is a criminal is a criminal. But in fact, if majority of our youth has something doing, it will reduce drastically the level of insecurity. By the time we train these youth to try their hands in one thing or the other, uh, it will give them uh, a, a self, uh, sense of belonging. Government cannot employ everybody. And that is why this very project comes up in order to complement the effort of the government. And you see this very pro uh, program or project is not only gearing towards the Boate people in Kaduna, uh, nationwide and diaspora. It has to do with everyone that is residing within Kaduna. It's a place of capacity building, not only for the Boate community, but every Timi youth is welcome to develop him or herself in that very place. Uh, even though you have the intention to develop, to build capacity of 200 or 2 million youths. Because we'll have computer uh, training center, we'll have tailoring training center, and a lot more. So it is our hope that at least we can start with at least 100 or 200 people. Hello, hope you enjoyed the news. Please do subscribe to our YouTube channel and don't forget to hit the notification button so you get notified about fresh news updates.